Well, Tim, you know, we've got a real double whammy for you here tonight. Uh, please show some love for Elvis Presley Enterprises Elvis? ultimate Elvis tribute artist, Dean oh. Z, an entertainer and dancer and hair and makeup extraordinaire, Steffi Z. Yeah. Hey, guys. How are you? Hey. Good. How are oh you guys my. doing? Wow. You guys all look and sound beautiful, by the way. We've been watching the whole show. So cool. It's amazing. You guys oh, my gosh. Way better. We paid them to tell you guys that. <laughs> well, I need it, so that's good. Well, you guys, without further ado, please tell us what you were going to perform for us tonight. Oh, goodness. Well, you know, there's so many, as you know, Doris, there's so many great Elvis songs that we get to sing in the shows, but I thought we would do a, a unique, cool acoustic version of I Can't Help Falling in Love with You. This is uh, oh, Steffi Z. He's going to knock this thing out of the park. I hope you guys yes. like it. I hope cry. everyone right. has their tissues. Yeah, I'm going to cry. Yes. <laughs> Wise men say, only fools, only fools that I should come for us. I can't fall in love with you. Shall I stay? Would it be a sin if I can falling in love with you? Like a river flows, running to the sea. Darling, I so wake up Some days are meant to be Take my heart Take my whole life too For I Falling in love with you, for I can't help falling in love Tearing up, and yes. I've heard that song seven thousand oh. times. <laughs> uh, you you got it. Seven thousand. Well, that was actually my next question. Like, you gotta tell us, like, how many times do you think you've performed that song? Got well, you know, in that style, in that style, that was the first time we've that ever is done true. it that oh. way. In we that... saved that for the Foxhole Live for oh, you guys. You guys. Oh. Um, that was but you amazing. know, like, you know, of, of course, Elvis, you know, we've, we've been doing shows. I've been doing shows since I was three years old. So I've been singing that song for my whole life, but yep. never like that. So <laughs> you're welcome, America. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And I'm sure they appreciated it. It was beautiful. I loved yeah. it. Thank um, you, guys. Thank you. So, so yeah, that kind of leads me to my next question, Dean, for you. Um, you've been in this sort of niche market, which is the Elvis tribute world, uh, for what seems like, I'm sure, a lifetime if you've been doing it since you were three. Um, yeah. But can you tell us a little bit about um, how your life changed once you won the 2013 title of Ultimate Elvis Tribute Artist? And I guess sort oh, of what that man. means for people who don't understand that this is a thing. Yeah, no, I mean, like, like anything, like bowling, there's a championship for anything, you know, so of course, like, <laughs> so I mean, but for for the Elvis world, I mean, I'm a huge Elvis fan, first and foremost, I've been a fan since I was three years old, and I've always, I've always just idolized Elvis, and, and I've had a full career ever since I was a little kid, ever since leaving high school, I've never really had a real job, just, just, uh, I've been singing my whole life and, and performing as Elvis Presley and making people happy around the world doing that, and it's been a beautiful blessing, but it really changed for me extra. You know, I was already performing with Legends in Concert, which is the world's uh, leading tribute show in Las Vegas. And they, they have shows all over the world. But uh, mm -hmm. I was already doing that. And then I won the ultimate, which is Elvis Presley Enterprises. That's like Graceland and, and Elvis Presley Enterprises. They have one contest per year. And that contest is the 
is the the title. You kind of right. win like the championship of the world. It's you like literally Miss get America. a belt. You get a belt. Really? <laughs> you get a belt. <laughs> like like in wrestling. <laughs> it is the heavyweight championship of Elvis World. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, you do get a belt. Funny I, enough, you do get I a do belt. Get a belt. <laughs> <laughs> like, it, it's amazing. <laughs> I got a gold belt, and and so they they picked me for 2013, and that kind of like busted open the the door for for me to be able to you know travel the world even more and now i have this uh, official title i'm I'm an ambassador to the elvis presley estate and also a a co-creator on some of their projects so i'm i'm i have to pinch myself all the time because i mean i can't believe that elvis presley enterprises even knows that i exist let alone lets me partner with them on stuff so it's it's pretty cool for an elvis fan it's the it's the the dream you know you're like the elvis of elvis I'm, I'm, tr- I'm trying. Yeah. I'm trying. Big, there's a big blue suede shoes to fill. <laughs> Which they might not recognize you anymore because you're kind of got that silver fox look yeah, going man. on. That's working for you. Silver fox. Look. I dig it. I do too. I'm not. Yeah. I'm not gonna say a, that. It's a, I just, think it's yeah. quarantine <laughs> chic is what I'm calling it right now. Quarantine. It's amazing. It's working. Um, well, let's switch gears a little bit and let's let's talk to your uh, your beautiful counterpart there, Miss Steffi Z. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Um, so, Steph, uh, not only do you sing and dance and have been doing that for many, many years, but you also work on the other side of the table uh, doing hair and makeup for all walks of life. Um, so can you tell us a little bit more about how you got into that? Yeah, sure. Um, so yes, I've been in the entertainment industry for 22 years. My I'm God, 35. So like most of my life, I started as a kid. Um, and in many capacities, entertainment and makeup go hand in hand. However, I was never really interested in diving in until I started working at Legends in Concert. Day in and day out, you literally see people transform from themselves into an entirely different human being. I would watch Dean go from himself to Elvis. Uh, I shared a dressing room with my friend, Stacey Witten Summers, if you're watching, hi. Um, She's a legend (laughs) in her own right. Um, Marilyn Monroe, Pat Benatar, Shania Twain, Katy Perry, Martina McBride, like whoever else the phone book. Um, She would change her face. And I was just so intrigued by the artistry of that and how it's done. So fast forward, we are living in Vegas and I decide like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and just, I'm going to do this thing. So I went out to LA and I attended school so I could get my professional certification. I learned uh, traditional makeup and makeup theory and airbrush hairstyling. And through that company, I was able to work which was a cool experience backstage at the Latin Grammys in Vegas. Um, So it was interesting because normally I would be the one dancing, but I was making up the dancer. So that was really my first time having this sort of flip. Yeah. But behind the table. Since then, I've done experience. some, yeah, some really cool events, um, some beautiful weddings. I've met some really great people. So after a few years in the industry, working as a professional, I was kind of thinking like, like what's next? How sure. could I make more of an impact with this? And I know it sounds cheesy, but I was meditating one day. And what came to me was the idea of merging two of my passions together. I had been on a spiritual journey trying to find myself and having the confidence to embrace my authenticity and just really love myself. That paired with the knowledge that I have in the makeup industry I was like, you know what, let's blend these two together because sure. as a new mom, I am fully, fully aware concealer, mascara, lip gloss can do a whole lot for you, but oh, if yes. what's going on <laughs> in the <laughs> inside if you're hurting in here, um, there's only so far that products can take you. So I felt like it was really important to blend those two things together in this beautiful marriage and out popped my online courses. And that was, what was that a couple of years, a couple ago? years ago? Yeah. Yeah, and so oh we've just kind of been working on that. You guys but, have just been the ultimate power couple, honestly. Um, I feel like ever <laughs> since you got together um, and on your own, you know, as well, but you're such an inspiration to a lot of us and a lot of viewers who Aww. are watching here. Yes, you guys are it's making really it all, all work with a seven-month-old, folks, mind you, with a seven-month-old. Oh. You're... The Still cutest little thing. baby in the whole white world. Yes. Oh, yes. She has many a theme song as well. She does. We sing to, We were just singing to her before we went live with you guys. Oh, my God. Can you 
sing the theme song just like really quick, just yeah. like really quick. This is the cutest baby in the whole wide world. Emily Joe, don't you know? Emily Joe, don't you know? <laughs> that was not planned. That's, That's so good. <laughs> I love it. You guys, thank you so much for being here. Oh my goodness. No, thank you guys for having thank us. Thank you for and having us. We're, oh, we're absolutely. We're so happy there's an amazing outlet like what you guys are doing for, for artists and for musicians and actors right now. Thank you for for the outlet to uh, still entertain people all around the world. That's what you guys are doing. So oh, gosh. keep Thanks, it up. You know, we're, Amazing we're work. doing the Lord's work over here. But, <laughs> yes, uh, you are. But world, Amen, if Amen. you want to snag Dean's latest album, The Nashville Sessions, or catch uh, one of Steffi's virtual dance classes, check out the respective links below. They've got great Instagram content. Yes, they check sure do. Oh, thank um, you. And Very. also be sure to set your Facebook notifications to partake in some of their live quarantine living rooms sessions which that link is also below um but thank you so much again you guys for being on foxhole live we love you you